retro recipes with you. Um, today we have Lauren here, aka Copper Top Inc. on Instagram. She is an incredible artist who does incredible things. Like seriously, she uh, do these these paintings right here. She uses actual makeup. It's incredible. She's just fabulous. Look at her. Look at her. And so today we are making Waisel. <laughs> Waisel. Waisel. Tell us more about Waisel. What is Waisel? It? Uh, well, it's a holiday drink, but it's Merry uh, Christmas. <laughs> my grandma, um, she would make it every holiday, so it was one of my favorite um, drinks to have every year. And then um, my mom started making it, so it's just become like something that the whole family always just kind of, you know, brings down to every year. So nice. it's one of my favorites. I'm excited, so let's just get started and make it. Yes. Okay, so what do we do first? So first, we're going to take our apple cider. So we're gonna use this whole thing of apple cider. Like, oh. I'm gonna Vanna wipe this whole thing. Yes, please. <laughs> so you're gonna pour, oh, and you're gonna use a crock pot, so that's what makes it even easier. So we're gonna use the whole thing of apple cider. Whoops! <laughs> it's gonna get everywhere. I'll back up. <laughs> and then, so I'll put this in. It's like I know how to what we're doing. <laughs> We're gonna do two cups of cranberry juice. Yum. Yum, yum. Always oh, delicious. Yes. And uh, let's see if I can do this without smelling. <laughs> um, I'm wearing black, so. I'm, I'm pretty clumsy, so I probably will spill something at some point. I came into her house today, and I <laughs> they are so lovely, and they got me muffins and orange juice, and the first thing I did was I just spilled the orange juice all over the table, so. I've already had my fair share of spills today. If it wasn't going to be you, it was going to be me because I spill everything. <laughs> then we're going to do a half cup of ginger. And a half cup, half teaspoon. Half teaspoon. I was like, that's, that's a lot of ginger. That's a lot. Half teaspoon. <laughs> it could be. Wait, that was the mace. See, oh, there okay. You go. This is the all spice. This recipe will be on my blog, so if you want to know the. Probably don't want to follow me. You <laughs> probably want to follow her blog. <laughs> And this is a half teaspoon of allspice. Oh, I was about to pick this up and... Okay. No, we're not putting that in. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yes, so we yeah. have all that in. And then you're going to add your um, oranges. And with these, which are fun, which are magically pre-sliced. Wow. Yes. Isn't that Legend. magical? <laughs> and we're going to put cloves in each one of the slices. Okay. And so we're just going to... I thought Leo. Pick one up. Oh, I have facts about Waisel. Oh, yes, tell Wassel. me. Wassel? Wassel. <laughs> um, okay, so, are you ready for this? I am, for actually, because, yes. Um, apparently, it is a medieval English Christmas time tradition, and they would drink it for a happy harvest of apples in the new year. Oh, I knew I liked this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Any of these? Uh, we put, I mean, it calls for eight. Oh, I mean, a lot of citrus, because it's like a spicier, kind of a citrusy drink. Okay, so we can put in as much as we can put, really. I also hear something else goes in it. Oh, yes, so, so, <laughs> we add a little rum for those special days. <laughs> you don't have to add rum. Well, we're adding rum. But we are totally going to add rum. Uh, my grandma never added rum, so it's kind of a thing that my mom added in. Mm. Yeah, I think that's a lot of oranges. That's a lot of oranges. Yeah, I think we're good. Oh, and uh, uh, cinnamon sticks. Cinnamon sticks. Four sticks. cinnamon sticks. Oh, actually, not four, three. I'm so glad you're going to have this on your blog. <laughs> <laughs> People are going to be like, I mean, a fourth one would hurt it very much. It would it? I mean, don't follow what she's saying. <laughs> oh, anyway, okay. Thank you. Yeah, well, okay. we'll team right okay. So does the rum go in now? Uh, well, I like to put it on after it's cooked, but otherwise, like, the rum just kind of disappears. Okay. So once it's done, and, yeah, and then once it's done, um, you can add a little shot in your mug or whatever you put it in. Yeah, <laughs> all right! Yes. It's going to cook for an, uh, an hour on high and then four hours on low. An hour on high, four, four 
hours on low. So yeah. Five hours total. Yeah. Okay, I'm super excited. So, <laughs> we'll be back here in five hours. <laughs> five <Yes>. hours. Okay. <laughs> five hours have gone by, five guys. Whole hours. Five whole hours. But it was worth it. Because now we have the wasel. <laughs> the wassel. <laughs> the wassel. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. So, okay. Uh, do you want to get yours first? Yes, yes, yes. There we, you go. We'll use a little later. <laughs> I think that's what it's called. Now, typically, you want to take the cinnamon sticks and the orange with the cloves out before you drink it. So, if you scoop it up and you get anything like that in there, don't drink it, please. Don't. Don't. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it smells, it smells, it smells. Delicious. Hey, we didn't spill. We didn't spill. Yes. Usually, that would be my first thing I do. Okay. I said we give a cheers. Yeah. Cheers. 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 Oh, cheers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh, it tastes like Christmas. I know. I know. We're filming this on January 18th, so Christmas is gone, but. Uh, it feels like I'm right back there. I know. I know. However, sometimes Christmas with the family is not always the best. <laughs> and when that happens, Yes. You always have your trusty friend. Mm -hmm. Well, <laughs> you can add a little bit of that in your drink, and it's already yeah. nice and spicy. I love spending time with you, but yeah. I think we should add some in. <laughs> yes. yes. Would you like so? <laughs> yes. <it is. laughs> I mean, spice rum is probably the best if you are going to add a little something something to yours. Um, you don't need a lot. Of, oh, a little cup, but I mean, if you want to. <laughs> Pour it in? Yeah, just a little bit goes a long I'm way. And yours in too. Oh yes, go Okay, for it. there we go. <laughs> but spice rum, I would recommend for this particular mm. holiday drink. Spice rum. Okay, cheers again. Cheers again. Cheers again. <laughs> I mean, really. I put a lot in this. <laughs> I saw you pour a lot, actually. <laughs> it's really good, though. <laughs> It's really good. It's really good. The rum was just like right there, and then I, I was just... like, "Whoa, you're really poor." <laughs> you All right. Mmm. It's good. Really... <laughs> I was like, "Boy, you had a long day." <laughs> Thank you so much. Yay! Wassail, everybody. Wassel. And now after we got some rum going, mm. I'm feeling. Very happy and excited about Jello and carrots, and now going in together. What are we making? It was my grandma again. I don't know exactly where she got it, but she would make it all the time. Not really always for the holidays, but she make this Jello with fruit and carrot, like salad mixture. And I've made quite a few of those on my channel. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I made a carrot Jello. Uh, yeah. Uh, pumpkin? So how does this start? What do we so, do? So, uh, we're gonna take a cup of uh, boiling water, which this would be pre-boiling water. I like it. Pretty hot water. We're gonna pour that in, and then you're gonna pour in the whole thing of jello. A lot of jello. Yeah, just the whole thing. What is your favorite kind of jello? Mm. I mean, the orange is good, but I like the watermelon. Remember those little, like, cut-out jellos, like, yeah. a long time ago? Yeah! What are they called? Uh, I don't know. You like what? They were, they were delicious. Whatever they were. Jello in school lunches. Oh yes, little Jello cups. Okay, so I poured it in, and now we're letting it dissolve. Yeah, let it dissolve a little bit, and then if you're impatient, I just stir it in. That. <laughs> That's me. Yeah, That's impatient. What I, do. I just stir it around. Yeah, it looks almost dissolved. Almost. <laughs> almost. And then we're going to add some, so you're going to get like a small can of pineapple juice and um, a can of mandarin oranges and you're going to add the juice in, actually, I'm going to do this first. I'm going to add the juice in here. And while you're doing that, what am I doing with these carrots? Oh, so we're going to shred these carrots up. Oh, okay. Uh, make about a cup of them. That's a lot of carrots. It, it calls for two cups, but I, I think one cup is pretty okay. I like the way she thinks. <laughs> I, think, I think it's all right. Let's see if I don't spill. Let's find out. Oh. Oh. oh yep. 
And I'm spilling. So. Yay! It happened! <laughs> yes. On camera! And then, um, so you can make about a cup of this, just about. I think I need some cold water. So I'm gonna grab some cold water real quick. Here we go. Bing! <laughs> So you're gonna make about a cup using the juice um, of the two fruits and then um, cold water. So you're gonna add that in. Just I like it so far. Yeah. This right? makes me question. Yeah. yeah. Then it gets weird. <laughs> <laughs> so then we're gonna go ahead and add our mandarin oranges, which I love mandarin oranges, so you can put it in the whole can if you want. Mm -hmm. It says half can. That looks pretty good. But I think that's okay, right? Yeah. Especially if you're gonna put it in a jello mold or yeah. And then I'm gonna use a small can of crushed pineapple. I'm just gonna add that in. Mm. Which I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I'm liking it so far. So yes. Far. <gasps> add that in. Okay, that looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. And then the carrots. So through the magic <laughs> of television. <laughs> I'll bring it for my dog later. Yeah, oh, do it, do it, do it. Okay. Yeah, I know. I, look at that. Yeah. Um, stir it around, and then you can put that in your favorite jello mold or whatever you want, and then you're gonna put it in the fridge for about like 90 minutes. That's it? Yeah. Wow. Okay, that's fast. Yeah. You can have this too within an hour or two. <laughs> We will be back in 90 minutes or less. So it has been 90 minutes mm -hmm. and we're going to go ahead and take this jello yes. out of its mold. And the really cool thing about this is this jello mold is actually my grandma's. <laughs> what? No. I can't find them for the life of me, the jello mold, <laughs> seriously. I use cake molds and everybody in the comments, you guys are lovely and you always give me such great advice, <laughs> but I don't have jello molds and I use copper cake molds. <laughs> Don't feel bad. I, 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 I don't either. So I you have this up to, to use this. So that's awesome. That's pretty cool. Let's hope that I did this correctly. Yes, I'm putting <laughs> good vibes. Look at it and admire it. It's very pretty. It's very pretty. But I have a feeling we should try it. I have a feeling, yes, we should. Look. Actually, my favorite part. I like the orange. Mm. That's why I'm like. Mm. Cheers to you. Cheers. <laughs> Should be in the history books. No kidding. Where? I think to go with this dish, <laughs> some wassail would greatly Just accompany to it. To wash so, it down. <laughs> I did not say that. <laughs> you somehow. I did. But I love it. Okay. I, I love, 
love yeah. both of them. I do. Also, fun fact that we discovered off camera. <laughs> Everything here is orange, yeah. and and so is our hair, and so is her name. Mm -hmm. So it's what is it? It's like a copper top, like lunch. With, no, what did you say? It was so good. Oh, it was copper, orange. copper, copper food with copper, copper top. Food with no, co <laughs> copper, copper lunch with copper. I don't know. Copper. What did Maybe. I say? Well, the title <laughs> will tell you what we came up with afterwards. There you go. Well, we were excited Initial. about it at the time. <laughs> lunch. Copper lunch. Copper lunch with copper topping. Copper topping. <laughs> so, if you want to see more about these recipes, um, head on over to my blog and you will find the recipes there. If you want to see some behind the scenes clip, like some Q and I's with this one. Uh, you might want to head on over to my Patreon because that's where that will be hmm, behind the scenes. Uh, but as always, don't forget to stay scrumptious. Hey, that's fun. <laughs> yeah, she did it. She did it. <laughs> Cute. That one looks like somebody else I know. Thank you. And that one also. They're so pretty. Well, I'm glad you like them because I made you a little something for yourself. I made it for you. I made you a drawing just for you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love it so much. I really. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. I loved your picture that you have where you look like Mary Poppins drinking tea. So I was like, oh, I'm going to draw that for you. I'm very popping to go. Oh, God. Thank you. Thank you. Like you. It. It's so beautiful. I'm so glad you like it. I got freckles. You do. I have freckles.